Frank Cacciaro lived down in South Florida quietly for over three years until one fateful afternoon in 1972 when he was driving to rent a car in Miami and had a slight fender bender with another automobile who blew a stop sign and hit Big Frank's car. The other driver insisted on calling a cop. When the cop arrived and asked Cacciaro for his license, Big Frank had three and two different names, one under his true name of Frank Cacciaro of Jackson Heights, New York, a chauffeur's license under the name of Frank Anthony Pagnata of Brooklyn, New York, and a Florida permit also under the name of Frank Pagnata. It immediately raised a red flag to the Florida policeman, especially when Big Frank gave an evasive explanation about why he had so many different licenses. Soon, authorities realized who they had in front of them. 